Good evening. I, I'm still overwhelmed that um, Speaker Pelosi is with us. This is a very, very special night. It was a special night to begin with, and now I think we'll, we will all remember it because um, we're connecting commitment and courage uh, with leadership, and those are evergreen values. And Tim, we appreciate so much our partnership with National uh, Geographic for co-presenting this program and hosting us this evening. I can't think of a better partner for public broadcasting than National Geographic. As I said, it's a very special evening, and it is the Washington, D.C. premiere of the Dwayne Bauman, Mark Siegel film about the life and work of an extraordinary person, Benazir Bhutto. She was extraordinary in so many ways, and Speaker Pelosi uh, gave us a vivid image of her coming to this country and that tagline, democracy is the best revenge. <laughs> the first woman elected to lead an Islamic nation. She was Pakistan's first and to date only female prime minister, a leader committed to bringing democracy to her people. And as most leaders who are change agents, she was a lightning rod for criticism. And I think it's interesting when you look at leadership, it's really not for the faint of heart. Unfortunately, assassinated not that long ago, December 27th, 2007, the following year she was named as one of seven recipients of the United Nations Prize in the field of human rights. As you know, the U.S. Uh, relationship with Pakistan is a very important one underpinning our country's engagement with the Islamic world. And I remember when I was privileged to visit Pakistan as uh, Assistant Secretary for Educational and Cultural Affairs, and I had the opportunity to meet so many wonderful Pakistani, including young women, for whom uh, Benazir Bhutto continues to be a role model and inspiration. And this is one of the reasons I was so pleased that Bhutto will make its broadcast television debut on the Emmy award-winning PBS series, Independent Lens, March 2011. Now write that down, March 2011, as part of public television celebration of Women's History Month. This film provides us with an opportunity to learn about this courageous woman and I hope it will spur uh, further interest um, in Americans to know more about Pakistan, its history, its leaders, its culture, its people. ITVS, led by the incredible Sally Pfeiffer, not only made tonight's premiere possible, she's made it possible for Bhutto to be shown at over 70 free community screening events early next year prior to the national broadcast. ITVS has also made it possible for this film to be part of the ITVS Women's Empowerment Initiative and their Global Perspectives Project, which works with NGOs and policy and community leaders incorporating film to provide opportunities for Americans to connect with and better understand other cultures. We're very proud at CPB of ITVS's connection to public media, helping us to consi uh, consistently deliver groundbreaking content, such as you will see in this film, and then beyond the broadcasting, making this content available to schools and to communities. It's so important to keep the conversation, keep the dialogue going, so we can promote mutual understanding mutual respect between the people of the United States and other countries.